there, Schultz here. Thank you for stopping by on my channel. Can you believe it? It's Miss Cutie graduation today. She's going to kindergarten this August. And to celebrate it, I made this lightbook style folio album for her and her classmates to keep the memories of this graduation or special memory throughout the preschool or even the artwork. There are 10 students graduating and that's why I have 10 folio albums here. They are all very, very simple and quick to put together. And I think it can be perfect project for a craft fair. I spent total like maybe six, seven hours to make all of this. And most of my time was spent on deciding how I, I want to put the, the layout and the paper. I use this graduation paper pad from Die Cut With Few. I got this a while ago and I use all 36 of this paper. And when laying this out, I decided I don't want any repetition. So it took me a while to decide which paper, which cut or where to go, go to where and how I want it to be. And so that there's no like repetitive pattern in each of the book. The layout of this album are all the same, but as you can see, the paper and the layout is kind of different. Not the layout, the, the paper pad are different. So I'm not going to like flip all of them. I'm just going to show you one. So this is very, very simple. On the front, I just put a little bit of collage or cluster. And here I put a note, a congratulation note to the kid and then telling the parent what is this book and what they can use it for. And here I put a photo mat so parents can put the photo of their children. On the back I just use a doily that I got from Dollar General like two years ago maybe. It's a gold and the other doily I used was silver and I thought it's just perfect for this project. And I just use my old pillowcase for the closure. And it's open like this and it's simple so it can be used to write journal or put photo and this side is open like this and it's a pull out waterfall each of these pages here can be used to put photo this one fits for by four photos or journal or artwork and on this side I made a tuck spot and here I put the cut out from the paper pad so parents can use these to embellish the photo or whatever, just complete this project. And here is a big pocket, enough for five by seven photos or six by six, whatever you want. One thing I forget to mention, the size of this album is six by six and a half by eight and a half inches. So it is a pretty decent size of album, which can fit quite a good amount of photos and on this side I just have a simple waterfall this fits six four by six photos and here I have a flap open and this is the pocket enough for a lot of photos as well so this pocket for parent can also put photo here and the embellishment the, from the cutout that I included and this flap here can fit up to six by six photos so yeah, this is a really, really decent size of album in my opinion, and it can fit quite a lot of photos. Let's see, maybe, I don't know, it's maybe like 20 photos or more. So yeah, this is my quick and simple project for the preschool graduation gift. And this one is the one that I made for my daughter. I made it slightly different from the rest. In that I put the doily over on the front. In the other project, I just keep the doily and tuck underneath the front cover. So my reason is there are some boys as well that's graduating. So my daughter is not going to girls only school and I don't want it to look girly. And that's why I just keep it simple and plain, not using glaze and just paper. And for my daughter, I know she's a girl. I know she's very girly. So I'm going to put a lot more embellishment here. And when I'm finished, I will show you the end result of this album for her. And thank you for watching. 
Happy crafting! Bye!